40 will be done for YouTube, and it's at Cyball and Presents on YouTube. Um, we have Chris Blake here on the keys. And Patricia Woodman is the uh, co-host with me and featured artist. As you can see, her work right out here in front. And uh, without further ado, I'll introduce and bring up Patricia. Patricia, would you please come to Pretty women wonder where my secrets lie. I'm not cute or built to a fashion model size. But when I start to tell them, they think I'm telling lies. I say, it's in the reach of my arms. The span of my hips, the stride of my step, the curl of my lips. I'm a woman, phenomenally, phenomenal woman. That's me. Does anybody remember a poem from the play Macbeth? Of course not. But do you remember this line? Double, double, toil and trouble, fire burn and cauldron bubble. So I wrote an emulation, and I call it Three Witches. But I bring it up to modern times, so I'm talking about three Jewish women living in the valley, making the cholent or Sabbath stew. Thrice the tappy round me meows, thrice and once the hound it howls, the parrot prods, go now, go now. In the fishbowl swirls the blue, the hamster wheels faster too. Turtle headless, deaf and dumb, days and nights hath thirty-one. Serpent strangles, mouse it caught, rabbit furtive drab the trot. Broil, boil, such toil, such trouble. Phoenix spring from the rubble. Fillet for the dog, slice steak. Kibble for the cat, sack shake. Tad reduce, simmer the frog. Warm for Polly, Polly's wog. For adder sport, cool the thing. Lizard's lunch, a cricket string. For a meal of delicious truffle. Gravy from the bowl, air bubble. Broil, boil, such toil, such trouble. Phoenix spring from the rubble. Wrap in metal, foil and fumble. Listen to those stomachs rumble. Surge of rectal, cricket wolf. If tummy tug, gnaw and gulf. Hold the ravish, sing fang lark. Rue of and I'll clod in the dark. Liver for the Sabbath stew, laurel leaves, bay slips a few, picked and dried by moon's eclipse, shallot knob, garlic bulbous, stems of green leaf, strangled braid, ditch delivered from the way, herbs fetch tither from off glass, make tasty thick green goulash, add there to a trident's entrails, cased in skin like cauldron tails, broil, boil, such toil, such trouble, wrap in metal, foil and fumble, listen to those stomachs rumble, double, double, toil and trouble, fire burn and cauldron bubble. Cool it with great press and good. Then the meals charm fitting food. By the crock we overcome something wicked this way young. <laughs> Does anybody remember how the raven begins? Yes. Once upon a midnight dreary, while I pondered weak and weary. Once upon a midnight dreary, while I pondered weak and weary. So I had to begin with something different, carrying the same thing. Twice under the twilight stirring, while I wandered worn and worrying over many a quaint and curious volume of night errant lore. While I tilted nearly snapping, suddenly I charged still cackling, as if someone crashing, crashing at this windmill door. Tis some sad maiden, I mumbled, strapped in by the windmill door. Only this and nothing more. Uh, clearly, I contend, sir, was during the dark December when each separate coin scepter sought reflection on the moor. Next featured poet, and everybody told me he goes by the name of GT, so we're going to have GT come on up here to the stage. And start um, glad to be here. Um, very happy uh, right now. I'm, uh, I'll be happy through uh, till March. In March, they're going to announce the winners of the uh, 2016 push card. And there'll be 70 to 75 winners. Uh, right now, there's 2,000 of us that are very happy and thinking, oh, we got a shot at it. Yeah. But anyway, I'm going to read you uh, my, my poem that's been nominated for a push card. It's called Pre-Code Classic. No, it's not called that. It's called Pre-Code Shocker. Excuse me. Turner's Pre-Code Classic Movies. Best watch on TV. Last week saw a silent film, Joan Crawford as Flapper Hoofer in 
our dancing daughters. It was Roaring Twenties morals on parade, so all the young girls were loose and free. My late arrival necessitated a storyline update. Daughter explained all during Af uh, Africa Hot Sunday Afternoon Kitchen Dash for cold refreshments while films played on. Wife shouted, new development and surprising twist. He's half black. To which we simultaneously responded, what? Half black? And without refreshments, quickly returned to the screen. Thank God for record, fast forward, and rewind. We rewound the broadcast. The dance ended. The male dance partner spotted an old friend and took his partner to his friend's table. He introduced his flapper dance partner to his friend, saying he was the best halfback on our college football team. Wife knows nothing of football, but it's a great idea for a red herring plot twist. He's black! Then, instant and shocking, fade to black silence. <coughs> Great school, jumping rope and recess, cheers, straight off the auction block. Two bits, four bits, six bits, a dollar, all for Galen Clark, stand up and holler. Push your back, push your back, way back. We're hip to the jive, come on team, skin them alive. Hip, 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 hoorah, hip, 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 hoorah. Rhyming line shouts of altruistic joys. With each hoorah, count 50 boys. Happening exactly how I need it to. You can only imagine the affliction that I'm living through. Expose a glimpse so you know about it. Know you doubt it at the moment that you approach it. See, I stay grounded. God made me a leader with intelligence. Set apart to deliver the medicine. Why do we have to cower to them? Why do we feel like we'll die if we don't? When does majesty and morality replace suffering and fear? When should we stop hurting each other? How do we connect to our shared heritage? How do we take back our center? What lies in our differences that can save us? What looms for the future that will unite us? Answers from within. Answers from our tears. Answers from the earth. Answers from our hearts. Answers from the one who has all power. Drawing nearer to the four seat swing, she is alone. The apparatus looks abandoned. Movement in the park stalled. It is quiet and still, a place for children. She sits on the canvas swing seat that gently cups her rear like a cradle. She wiggles her bottom to comfort, grabs hold to the chill chain handles anchored above her head, watches her bare toes turn ashy in the dry sand. Legs and feet push back, beginning the pumping motion that will urge her body forward toward the middle sky. Leaning back all weightness and light, her toes reach upward, higher. Higher than her lifted chin, the sky spreads wider. My baby drives a red truck. I love him, though he's twice my size. My baby drives a great big bus. I love him, though I'm supposed to be the price. My baby is Nomad Damon. He looks nothing like how I envision him to be. His eyes are no gems or sea, but fixed like dead blue glass. Be one with the universe. Let it take you to places your heart and soul desires to go. Block it. 